Hi, everybody, and welcome again. So we're back for another episode. We're back for another episode, and I just want to let you some- know something right off the bat. Um, I was really proud of myself with that whole, um, what was it, magma cube spawner that I made. So I want to let you know that this episode that I'm recording right now is actually, I'm recording it right after the last episode. So it's sort of, I'm going to upload it. Um, I, I have to set it to, um, to, like I set it to automatic, I schedule it to uh, show online the next day. I normally don't pre-record any episodes, um, but this specific one, I'm going to be away for one day, basically. So I wanted to make sure I get the episode out. So you're going to see. So the reason why I'm telling you this, actually, I always do episodes one a day, especially since I do them late at night and it's very late right now. (laughs) So, but this is my second episode I'm recording in a row because I'm letting you know, because I mentioned in the last episode, since I had a problem with the spawner, well, a major problem because, (laughs) because the spawner just keeps spawning and doesn't stop. And I asked you guys to help me in the comments. So if you see that I haven't changed, that I'm not going to I can't change it yet because I don't, you know, obviously if this is pre-recorded, if I'm recording this actual episode before you actually answer me, obviously then I won't know what to do. So yeah, it's crazy down there. I know. Look at that. I, you can hear it. I don't need to even go down. So, um, yeah, so I just want to let you know this, this episode right here has, is, I'm recording it right after the last episode, right after I actually built this, um, this spawner and, uh, somehow it's just out of control, right? So I won't be able to actually, you know, implement anything that you actually tell me to do because, like I said, I'm recording this one right after, but the next day, hopefully, in the next episode, of course, I will definitely be, uh, hopefully, uh, be able to fix this problem that I have of unlimited spawning. Ah! Anyway, I'm back here. I'm sorry. I don't want to bore you guys again because I did this a long time in the last episode. I just want to see if I get one more. Yay, I got it, right? I have eight. That's what I needed. All right, guys, I am out of here. Let's get out of here before it gets even crazier. All right, eight. Thank you. That's all I needed. I'm out of here. Not going to bother anybody again. Sorry. This closes up because I'm scared that they're going to come out of it. All right. Oh, the wisp. Go away, wisp. Go away. No. Oh, actually, let me kill it. Oh, oh. It flew up. No! Where'd it go? Oh, it's too high. Now it's going to kill me for sure. Oh, I had my chance. It was right down there, and I didn't get to the sword in time. Ugh. Well, one more hit, it should do it. So hopefully, I'll be able to get it next time. Yeah, that nasty wisp is mine. All right. Do they spawn more wisps later? Hmm, I don't know. I'm not really sure. All right, so I can finally craft something with my magma... Creams. Yay! So happy. Okay, guys, so what we want to craft is, I think I mentioned, I want to make a blast furnace. And this is to create steel, which we need so that I can make a feeder for those wonderful cows, even though, yeah, it's getting out of control. But if I get rid of some of those cows, then I'll make some space. And then we could set up our new Steve's cart. So this is going to be a couple episodes. It won't be all in this episode. We can set up our Steve's cart that is ready to be used as a shooter to kill those animals. But hopefully they'll just keep, um, I think it, it, it will be a slow process. So I think there's enough time maybe for some to actually breed or maybe not. I'm not really sure, but let's first go ahead and make the feeder because I want to see how that works out. Well, I'm sorry. Let's first, let's start one step at a time. Let's make the blast furnace first. So what do we need for a blast furnace? Oh, by the way, as you can see, I'm back to the default texture pack. I decided maybe I'll just take it like one day at a time. It depends how I feel that day. Today, I feel default. You know, I feel kind of defaulty. That's how I feel today. And maybe tomorrow I'll feel a little Sortex, you know what I'm saying? Or Sfax, I don't know. It just depends on the day. You know, everybody has different moods every day. So today's def- my default day. Today I'm kind of having a bleh day, so it's <laughs> it's default. Alrighty, so let's click on Blast Furnace. So Nether Brick, Soul Sand. So what do I need here? A lot of this stuff, actually. How much Soul Sand do I have? Let's see. Uh, soul sand. I know I got some soul sand somewhere. Uh, soul sand. Here we go, 35. And do I have any nether? Oh, I do have nether brick. Five of them. Okay. Well, first off, I'm going to need to craft another iron sword. I mean, I'm sorry, an iron pickaxe. That's what I meant to say. Iron pickaxe. So let's get, uh, three of these. So we're going to need an iron pickaxe and, uh, I'm going to need a shovel too. So actually... 
Let me head back and grab another one for a shovel for the soul sand, right? So let's go to the nether and grab all this stuff, all this stuff that I need. Um, I'm just going to put stuff away that I don't need so I don't look, I've messed up. I had it so nicely organized, everything, and now I'm just putting everything everywhere, not really caring, and it's not good. So, all righty, let's get this stone sword out of here. Bo oh, I should have left my bones there because I had that nice chest full of bones. All right, so I want to set this up, and I'm going to leave my magma cream actually here. I don't want to take it with me because I don't want to lose it, even though, you know, I got the spawner, but still. Uh, oh, let's leave these bones here as well, actually. Um, cool. Okay, so let's head to the nether. All right, well, let me, oh, wait, first I got to make my, I've got to make my uh, shovel and my pickaxe. Uh, there we go, shovel. Cool. And my pickaxe. You know, I was thinking maybe I should make thomium ingots, and I have a lot of, what are thomium ingots made of, actually? I think we can make a bunch of them. Because thomium gear, like I can make a full set of thomium gear and enchant it. That must be pretty nice. And not only that, I can actually, whoa, what we want is nether brick. So um, let me just head over here. Um, so yeah, I can get a whole, um, yeah, I can, I can make a whole suit of armor and like all my tools and my, you know, sword and stuff of thamim and have it enchanted it could be pretty nice it could look nice on me actually yeah i think it'll look nice on me let's see um let's see how i'm looking right now all right i'm looking okay right now i'm always looking good right i'm always looking good <laughs> but i think uh <laughs> i think glowy thamim gear would be much much nicer oh that's not good a gas is trying to shoot me where is he where is he that he's i hear him right I don't know. That would be nice to have a gas uh, spawner. It'd be pretty interesting, actually. I'd like that. But I think down in that room, I'm not going to add any more spawners. What do you guys think? <laughs> yeah, I don't think. Nah, I think I'm good. I think no more spawners there for me. Whoa. Let's see how many. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. Where is he trying to shoot me from? What do we got? 30 bricks? All right, we're doing all right. Gosh, those gas just, ugh, they can't stand me. They're just, like, ruthless, really. Okay. Just breaking everything in my way here. And hopefully then we'll have enough stuff to make our, um, to make our blast furnace. That's what we're making. We need to make steel. So that's really what I want to do in this episode. So let's go ahead and do it. Let's just have a small goal and try to achieve that goal. Okay, I think this is enough. And what was the other thing I needed? Um, we need enough. Oh, soul sand, right? But I think we have enough. But I could just jump down and grab. Hopefully, the ghast is away now and won't attack me anymore. Okay. This nether brick actually looks pretty nice. Okay. So let's head down. I mean, there's a soul sand right over here. See? Whoa, whoa, this is a long drop. There we go. Now we're good. Right here. Tons of soul sand. Oh, oh, he's shooting me. Ah, run away. Where is he? Where is he? All right, all right. Forget about him. All right. Let's just grab some, because this is fast with a shovel. Cool. How many do I have already? Should be good already. Yeah. Let's just grab a couple more. A couple. Of course, I grab like, you know, a hundred more. No. All right, we should be okay now. That should be more than enough. Let's head back home. And, um, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, he's like shooting. Where is he? I, I still haven't seen him. He must be floating around over there. And they have wild blue. I want to say wild blue yonder, but it's actually wild lava yonder. All right. Let's head back. All right. <sighs> okay, safe in my home. Yay. Okay, so, uh, yeah, we want to craft the, so we need the magma cream. So where did I leave the magma cream? Yeah, I left it somewhere. Who knows where? Um, magma cream. There we go. Yay. Okay, so we got our soul sand, our magma cream, our nether brick, and there's uh, more soul sand, right? Here we go. Cool. And uh, what was the other thing I needed? No, that was it right for now. Okay, so let's go ahead and craft our blast furnace. So, we need these pieces. So, let's go ahead and I think we need eight. I think eight. 
is what we need, which will give us 32. I think that will build us a full, if I have my, if I remember how to do a little math in my life. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, of course, I know math. I'm just kidding. Oh, gosh, everyone's going to leave comments. You don't know math. What are you talking about? All right, let's put uh, soul sand. Soul sand. Soul sand. All right, cool. So I think we're good. Yeah. 32. I think I've got that right. Now, um, where do I want to build this is the question. Where do I want to build this? I'm thinking over here now. It needs to be four high. One, two, three, four. And three by three. So, the thing is, I don't know if it could be moved later, but, okay. So, three by three, hmm, it's not going to look so nice over here, is it? Uh, boo, 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 boo. Should I worry about it? Should I just do it? One, two, three. It could be in front of one of these windows, but I really didn't want to do it on this side. I wanted to keep this for machines, and I would have liked to put it over here. So I'm just going to put it where I want to put it. Yay, all right, yeah. I'm the boss of everything, right, of me, so I'm going to do it like this. I think it's like this. Okay, I believe I'm doing this right. Please, please tell me I'm doing this right. So, uh, let's see. Oh, yeah, that's not good. I can't get up here, so actually I could just do it right against, right? Okay, so something like this, three by three, right? And then we have to leave a space in the middle, basically. So, so far, so good. Okay, that's that goes. Now here, we close this top part. See? So we close the top, but the middle is going to be hollowed out. So I believe now, if I do it right, there'll be a little square at the bottom. Oh! Whoa! Three by three. Hmm. Hmm. So why did I think there was only 30 to I need two more pieces? Ah! Oh, how did I figure this out wrong then? One, I counted, I counted, I'm sure I counted. One, two, three, four, nine, right? Nine and nine is 18. All right, 18. And then you got four here and four here is another eight. So that's 24, 25, 26. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm totally wrong here. I had 32, didn't I? 32. 9 and 9 is 18. 18. Uh, let's see. 18. 18. 24 here, right? 24 and another, another 6, right? Another 6, 24, and another 6 is 30. 32, that's right. So I need 34, actually. I totally miscalculated this whole thing. Wow. All right, well, let me stop the video not to waste you guys' time again and your time. And I'll be back in a minute as soon as I... So I need one more... <laughs> I can't believe I need one more magma cream. Again, back to the magma cubes. Ugh, tiring task. Okay, I'll be back in a minute. Okay, guys, I'm back, and I did get one more magma cream, so sorry about that. I miscalculated, so <laughs> I hope this works out. All right, let's put our nether brick around, magma cream in the center, and four pieces of soul sand. Yes, so four more blast furnace uh, bricks. And if I do this right, which I hope I do, please, here we go. There we go, yes. So as soon as you see this little square, it is working. So now let's right click and you can see, there it is, the blast furnace, yay. So now basically, as far as I understand, we can make iron into steel, yes. So let's try it out, I'm excited. So let's just grab like, uh, let's grab 10 of these. Oops, sorry, I don't know what I'm clicking here. All right, let's see. So uh, let's try. Let's see, so the blast furnace. Oh, doesn't take coal. Let's see, how do we heat up the blast furnace? I, you know what? I didn't check on that actually. I'm new to the blast furnace. Totally new. I've never made steel ever. Um, I actually, what I want to make is, let me just check it again to show you. The reason I'm doing this is I want to make this feed station, which we need the steel plate, which we need four pieces of steel, which means we need to cook it in a blast furnace. Oh, it's showing charcoal or coal coke. Charcoal or coal coke. So you're telling me we can't use coal, only coal, coke, or charcoal. Isn't that weird? 
Alrighty, let's see if that's right. Let's see if that is correct. I don't even believe this. Let me cook this up. Um, where's all that wood I got, like, way back when my axe of the stream came in handy? Here we go. Let's take these logs and this. Let's try this. Let's head down to my good old-fashioned furnace and let us cook up. Yeah, I'm using these stairs because I'm probably not going to use them for anything, so let's go ahead and cook up some logs with my redwood stairs. <laughs> Might as well use it for something. Why take up space if I'm not going to use these stairs for anything? So, charcoal. Hmm, very interesting that charcoal works and coal coke works, but not coal. So let's see if this is true. All right, charcoal. Let's just try these two pieces and see if I got this right. Let's see. It looks pretty cool in that spot. I like it. It looks kind of scary looking. <laughs> Yay, it works. Charcoal or coal coke. You cannot use coal. There we go. Something new. Learn something new every day. So we're cooking up uh, steel. So let me just have charcoal cooking all the time because I think this is going to use a lot of charcoal. And I'm going to put my two bricks from the blast furnace that's left over away. And let's go ahead over here and just make sure we are full of, yeah, doing good. Actually, I thought I had, no, I don't have more fur logs, but now it'll be so easy to get logs with the axe of the stream. So I'm loving that tool, actually. That was good. Of course, I could have gotten a much better enchant than I did, but of course I didn't. My life story. Yeah. But now I have a good enchant level, so we can enchant something amazing. That's why I'm thinking maybe we should make, like, all Thaumium gear. What do you think? I think that could be a pretty good idea. Oh, you see how fast that charcoal goes? Didn't even reach. I, mean, I didn't get. I didn't even get one piece of steel yet. Let's grab our thamanamakan. Thamanamakan. I can never say that. <laughs> I have no idea how to say that. All right, I don't remember how to make these. So, uh, in the crucible, it's just metallum and magic. Okay, and we get five. Oh no, and five easy. We get one thamium ingot. That's pretty cool. So, yeah, see, so we can make all these items, and, um, you know, it's got good durability. Oh, look at the helm. I love the way that looks. And then if we, oh, I love all the gear. Oh, definitely. We're definitely going to have to do that. I'm definitely going to have to make a ton of those uh, Thami Mingots. All right, steel ingot, yay! So remember, we want the feed station, so we just need four pieces of steel. Steel ingot to make, oh, I need a rolling machine. Oh, there's always something else that I need. Rolling machine, rolling, rolling. Let's go rolling. All right, rolling machine. Well, this is easy. Easy. Oh, gosh, it's easy, just a pain. We need pistons, iron, and a crafting table. Okay, so iron we have. Um, whoops, sorry, wrong button. Whoa, wrong button again. <laughs> wrong button. Just keep pressing the wrong button. Okay, so let us know. You know what? I'm going to take all these water... I don't need them now. Water buckets and put them away. And let's head over to, her, this, to this nice, beautiful obsidian chest. And let us just get rid of junk. Um, this one I can get rid of. Okay, cool. And then what do we have here? Let's get rid of the glass. And what else goes in here? Um, some dirt. Some sand goes in here. Let's organize it. All right, cool. Just trying to get rid of all this stuff. Now, where am I going to put these blocks of... Um, where do I have room? I'm going to put these soul sand and nether brick in here. So that'll be good. Oh, and the blast furnace pieces. Let's just leave that there. So I need some redstone. I think we'll need, how much redstone do I need there? Four? Four for the pistons, I think only? I think so. So we've got iron, redstone. Um, we need wood, which we have here. I don't know if that's enough just now. And um, let's see, rolling machine. Piston has, right, cobble, cobble. That's all I'm missing is cobble. So let's grab a, a stack of cobble. Cool. Let's organize that again. And how are we doing on steel? Do I have enough charcoal? No, of course I don't have enough charcoal. Only made one ingot. Oh, gosh, got to go grab some more charcoal. Let's go head back down here to my furnace, my good old-fashioned furnace. And, yes, uh, this is not cooking up, so I need this wood. Actually, um, okay, hold on a second. Let us make some more planks, right? And let us cook this up. There we go. That's better. That's better. So now I've got some charcoal. And what else did I need? Am I good? I think so. 
Just let it continue making charcoal. But I think this might be enough for the ingots. Let's see if this is enough, these 10 pieces. Oh yeah, it's almost there. So I think we'll have enough to make uh, the, the extra two pieces we need of steel or steel ingots. Okay, so uh, let's get to it. Let's start crafting some pistons and some a rolling machine. And then I need to power it. So um, I can use conduits, right? Let's see. Let's see. I really don't know. So what do I need to do? I need to go to the crafting table. And I need to make pistons, right? Pistons, super easy recipe. So we need four of them. So let's make four. There we go. And let's make four. And we've got four of everything. There we go. Four pistons. Yay. Awesome. And then we need to actually craft. Oh, I need a crafting table. So let me go ahead and... Oh, not enough wood. Of course, I run out of wood. Let's head back over. Oh, I have that in the... I keep saying, oh, aren't I saying that too much? What's wrong with me today? You know what? It is so late. I think it's 3 a.m. I can't tell you how exhausted I am. It's out of control crazy. <sighs> okay, I can do this, guys. I can do just a little bit longer. Just a little bit longer. I can do this. I'm not going to give up. Not going to give up. So there's our crafting table. Cool. So let's go back to our rolling machine. Alrighty, so we've got our four pistons. Super easy recipe. Crafting table and iron all around. That was easy. Rolling machine. Just when I thought I had everything, there's always something else I have to craft. Alrighty, so um, let's head over here. And cool, three steel ingots. Oh, I need one more though, one more. I think we'll make it though, we'll make it. Okay, so... Um, Rolling machine, hmm, I don't know because it's constant power. Can I just, um, let's see, do I have an energy conduit? Um, I can move it after actually. Um, so let us just see if I can, um, what's in here? Oh, I just put the buckets in here. Let me break this chest actually. Let's break this chest. I don't need this chest here for now. And let's see if I could get my rolling machine temporarily here. I don't know if it has to be where the input is. Ah, wow. Cool. Nice power. Okay, so that got a lot of power right away. And now, uh, last piece of steel I need. Last piece of steel. All right. Cool. So that's it. We just need to make that steel plate, which is placing these four pieces in the rolling machine like that, like a square. I click on this. Oh, whoa, whoa, I didn't mean to do it. Click it. There we go. I don't know why you have to click it to get it going. Um, if you only have one set, but if you have several, then it starts moving. Oh, what happened to the power? What happened to the power? It's odd. Let's see. There we go. All right. <laughs> there we go. Thank you, power. I don't know how it got powered. There must have been power saved up in there, right? How did it get power to begin with if it wasn't on? All right, so we have three steel plates. Cool. So let's go to our feed station. That's what I really want. Look how long all this stuff takes. It takes forever. Okay, so we need planks and golden carrots. Yay, golden carrots are nice. They're just cool looking, don't you think? I think so. All right, here's one golden nugget. And let's make more golden nuggets. So we want nine and another nine. Okay, um, we need, let's see, six and eight, right? So we need eight, eight and eight. We need 24 golden nuggets in total. Am I right on that? I think so. Okay, and we need, um, oh no, we need four carrots. So it's um, 32 nuggets, right? So I made a mistake there. So, please tell me I have gold. I mean, I have gold. It's just I don't want to have to cook it up. All right. I'm going to have to go back over here and cook it up in the pulverizer. You don't want to waste this kind of stuff, you know. So, I don't want to waste it. So, let's go ahead and pulverize it one step at a time. It's always one step at a time. There we go. Cool. Pulverized gold and then open up. I should have had it open so it goes through, but okay, I didn't have it open. Sometimes I do um, things where I don't want it to go right from the pulverizer to the, um, okay, there we go. 
to the power furnace. So sometimes that does happen. Alrighty, cool. Now I'm ready to roll. Okay, now we need four carrots. Wow, one step at a time. It takes forever. One little thing, one little thing, and it just takes forever. Alright, let's head off to sleep because it is nighttime. And I always can't stand, you know, monsters bugging me or or if I don't go to sleep right away and monsters come nearby, then then that's it for me. I'm done. Okay. So we have four carrots, and what we need is 32. Um, sorry, what am I doing? I'm like going crazy here. It's only four in each spot. Four, four, right? Yeah, so four golden carrots. I do have that le leftover, though. All right, back to the feed station. So let's see this recipe. Four pieces of planks, right? Wooden planks. Four golden carrots and one steel plate. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. A feed station. Yay! Awesome. All right, let's move those cows over. Cows, move over. Get out of my way. Come on. Come on, get out of the way. All righty. Come on, get out. Get out of the way. Okay, come on. Get. Oh my gosh, this is like they're not letting me do anything here. They are really just driving me crazy here. What do I have in this chest? You know, I've had this chest since the beginning of the game. Oh, absolutely nothing valuable. Okay, let's get these guys out of the way here. They are just not letting me do anything here. I really should uh, actually use a sword and take care of some of these guys. There we go. Let's clear the way here. There we go. There we go. Okay, we still have some cows left. Some have escaped. That's all right. I'm not too worried. Okay, so there we go. Our feed station is down. Awesome. So I guess we got to fill it, huh? So wait, wait, close this. There we go. Oh my gosh, they're all over the cows. <laughs> That's why, see, right now I needed the shooter working, the Steve's cart shooter. All right, let's head over here. And wow, I haven't come over here. I'm definitely going to need um, some kind of good farm system going here because I've had this forever, you don't know, and I have not come over here in such a long time. And I should have because I could have collected a ton of wheat, but I haven't, so let's grab all this stuff. This actually looks pretty cool in the default texture pack. Yeah, that's what I said. I feel kind of default like today. So that's why I did that. Okay, so let's plant everything again. Now remember, I don't have a red power installed here because this is Feed the Beast Magic World, okay? The reason I used Magic World, just in case you guys don't know, is um, I started that series because Magic World was out before the Dire Wolf 20 or the Ultimate Pack. It's the only reason I chose this um, at the time, and I wanted to get the series, I wanted to get a Let's Play going right away, so that's the reason. But I think it's progressed nicely. I know that there's, there's lots of mods that I don't have here, but for now it's okay. Um, I do also have my server, the Dire Wolf 20 server, so that's good. Um which hopefully I could progress there as well. But I do really, I am really interested in that ultimate mod pack as well. So, so many mod packs and so little time. Oh my gosh, this is insane. What is going on here? Oh yeah, it's because I've got the, the weed in my hand. That was, uh, whoa, what am I doing? Ah, I let the bucket go. Oh, I got milk instead. <laughs> oh my gosh. Woo! You know it's 3 o'clock in the morning, let me tell you. When I start, like, first, I had a bucket in my hand. Then I let the water go, and I didn't realize. And then I tried to get the water back, and instead of getting the water back, look, they're eating. Eat. Eat, cow. Eat your beautiful wheat. Yes, I'm here. Eat your wheat, wonderful cow. You're a wonderful... Yes, I love you, too, with your beautiful little hearts. Oh, yay. Little babies will come now. Yay, wonderful... Ooh, why did I click that? You see, I am just clicking the wrong... Let's see, where's the baby? Baby, where is it breeding? Come on! Eat more wheat, guys! You've got your feed station. Where's... Oh, is this guy drowning? I'm sorry, buddy. I'm really sorry you jumped in the water, but I never saw a cow swim, so it doesn't look good. So only one cow has eaten the wheat. Come on, people. Come on, people! Look at this guy. All right. I'm sorry, guys, but you're really cramping my style. You're all over the place. It's insane. And people in the videos are just not going to be liking this. They're going to be like, get rid of those cows. They're crazy all over the place, out of control. 
I didn't think cows like to swim, really. I have to say, I'm, why are they here? What are you guys doing in here? Weird places for them to go. Like, I'm just surprised that they... Oh, there we go. Okay, where's the baby? Yay, a baby! Two babies! Yay, I love the feed station, guys! All right, I know I sound crazy today. I know. Guys, I I'm so sorry, but really, it's three. I'm not joking. Or By now, it's 3.20 already. <laughs> Oh, 3.20 in the morning. I have to sleep at some point. Obviously, I don't sleep much. Alrighty. My inventory must be totally full. Oh, at least I got a bucket of milk out of it. Cool. Alright. So we got our... How did you escape? How did you come out of there, of the pen? Go back in the pen. I'm not allowed to get out of the pen. Oh my gosh, you know, I'm just going to let them run free, poor guys. Look at that guy, he's smart. He went on the ice all the way over there. He's still going to totally escape. I'm just going to let them ride, run free. All right, so that's what I wanted to make, a feed station. I never made that before, but it's quite a little expensive. It's difficult. You need those magma creams. Not easy, because you need to make a blast furnace, which is just not an easy item to make. doesn't make my life simplified at all. How are we doing here? Oh, I'm going to have to go get some more charcoal. Make some more. Am I making more? Let me just make sure that that is running, making charcoal all the time. I need to have lots of charcoal running in case I need to make something else there. So what do we have here? Oh, good. 18 pieces. That's not too bad. Let's get another eight going. Cool. All righty. Awesome. Okay, guys. So we made our feed station. We got our cows all happy and well fed and little babies. But why are they escaping? How'd that little guy escape? And then I have cows all over a big cow mess. Crazy cow mess. Do I have wheat? Oh, yeah, I got tons of wheat here, actually. Let's see. Um, I think I could lure them back. Um, let's try that. Let's just, because just for curiosity here, I'm just wondering, should I lure them back in? But there are too many. I, I shouldn't even put them back in. I should just, you know, here we go. Come, come, beautiful baby. Yes, I love you too. You're a beautiful little cow baby. Come, cows. Come to me. Yes, come in this direction. Wait a minute. Come in here. You, you, back. Go oh, back, back, this way. See? Through the door, through the door. Come on, you. Oh, my gosh. Nobody listens. Nobody cares what I'm doing. Now they don't pay attention to me. All right. I don't think I lured any of them in. How did this guy get out is what I want to know. Like, before... <gasps> Guys, I need my soul shard. <laughs> guys, guys. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Where's my soul shard? I put it in a safe place. Do you remember? Where where was the safe place that I put it? I don't remember. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm going to freak out. I'm, oh my gosh. There it is. Okay. 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 Just be calm. Stay calm. Stay calm. I have my sword with me. Okay. Stay calm. Is he still there? Please tell me he's still there. Please tell me he's still there. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh. I am so unlucky with these Endermen, I'm telling you. It's just, it's awful. It's bad. Hmm. Yeah. All right. No Endermen for me today. I thought, that's it. I've got the Endermen. And nothing. He just poofed right in front of me and disappeared. I knew that was going to happen. Let me just scope out the area. Oh, he's in my house. He's in my house. Please don't poof away. Please don't poof away. All right. Let me get ready. Let me get ready. Oh, my gosh. I am totally dying. He's in my house. He's in my house. He's in my house. Don't move. Don't move. Please, please. please. Yes! I did it! Ah, I did it! Oh my gosh! Guys! It's 3.30 in the morning and I got a yes! Woohoo! Yay! I'm clapping for myself! Oh my gosh! I can't believe this. I, you know what the funny, come on guys, you gotta admit, this is hysterical. Since the beginning I've been saying I want a soul shard of Enderman because I need, um, Ender Pearls. And I just can't believe that after all this time, I killed the Enderman inside my house. It's like he came to me. I mean, come on. Is that, oh, there's an Ender Pearl. Oh my gosh, he dropped an Ender Pearl. I need this Ender Pearl. Oh my gosh, I have no more space in my inventory. Get rid of something I don't need. Yay, one ender pearl. <laughs> now I can make exactly one tesseract as of right now because I have exactly four ender pearls. Yay, but actually you need two really to do anything with them. But I'm so happy that I have this shard. Okay, what was the last thing I needed? What was the last shard I needed? I said I needed an enderman shard. I needed a um, 
what was that uh magma cube shard which i got which somehow i messed up that whole spawner i don't know what i did you guys have to help me out with that okay and third i need a slime i need to find a slime and i need to make a shard of a slime this way i can um I, whoa whoa that was not uh, very smooth of me, was it? Not for someone who did well and got the Enderman. Not very... S oh, I really need some more chests. This is getting crazy out of control. Oh my gosh, there it is. I'm going to leave it there in this beautiful place, which I won't remember it's there. But guys, please remind me it's there. Oh my gosh, my Enderman shard. So now I'm going to have to get one of these to a tier 5. I'll just have to go to that um, nice Extreme Hills uh, Miscraft age that I have. And where are all my... Oh, here. Yeah, so we've got a cow shard, a chicken shard. Oh, I forgot to use my cow shard. I should have. Skeleton is tier four. We're almost there. We can almost have a full Enderman farm. Yay. Yay. Now, I don't know how to create an Enderman farm. I'm going to have to learn because, you know, since they poof away, I'm not sure how to keep them at bay, basically. Um, I've seen Enderman farms with water, but the water is just to collect, right, the items. Um, there's no real way to... I've seen lots of different. I've seen the one that they fall. I've seen... Actually, I've seen the one that they fall to their complete death, where you don't have to hit them at all. And they still drop items. It mu it won't give XP, though. So, you know, maybe that's a good idea, because I don't really care for the XP of the Enderman, as long as I get the pearls, right? So I believe if they fall to their death, you still can get the drop, if I'm correct on that. And uh, maybe I could use a Steve's carts, like with a cleaning machine to clean up the area. Maybe that would work. I'm not really sure. So, or just the water like everybody uses to push it over to, or no, the golems, right? The golems pick them up. My golem, I don't know, he disappeared. My golem in that spawner, I guess I overdid it and it was too much for him. And he either committed suicide over there, <laughs> he hurt himself over there. Or I don't know what he did. He just was like, I'm out of here. He just escaped out of there. He was like, I'm not, uh, I'm not playing here anymore, so... Yeah, I don't know what happened over there. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. I think this is a pretty, um, I'm pretty proud of myself. So I hope you, give, you guys give me a thumbs up, a nice like on this episode. I want to thank you so much for watching. But really, look, we've got the feed station going. We've got all those little baby cows all over the place. And cows, I don't know, cows all over, like, it's a bit out of control. But the feed station is nice. Look how it's working out really, really well. And um, we made a uh, blast furnace. I said we made the feed station, and last but not least, the best part of the whole day was the Enderman came to my house, and I got him with one shot, and we've got our soul shard of Enderman, so now I could get Tesseract, yay, we could really get rolling now, now we could be doing some cool stuff, yeah, or at least more efficiently, I guess I could get the quarry and everything running, so guys, thank you so much for watching, have a wonderful day, and uh, like I said, please, you know, I just want to thank you for all the support. It's really awesome. So remember to leave a like. It helps me out and just makes my day happy, especially since it's like 3.34 in the morning right now. <laughs> all right, guys. So have a wonderful day and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.